Well, if you've been on one of those commercial flights, you have been told repeatedly, ad nauseum, what to do in case of an emergency. If needed, an oxygen mask will appear from above you. Pull down on it. Don't jerk it out of the roof, just pull down on it to be that the cord is, to be sure the cord is not encumbered. Then you secure it around your own face and mouth. Has anybody ever gotten that instruction? Yeah, good, I got the right group, me too. Secure it around your own face and mouth before you consider helping anyone else. Even if you're traveling with small children, before you can help them, you have to secure the oxygen around your own face and mouth. However, if you secured your oxygen flow and you looked around yourself on the airplane and you saw that all the seats immediately adjacent to you and the, the rows in front and the rows behind were filled with children and you didn't help any of them, you just watched them struggle and watched them move into oxygen deprivation, but you had your mask on. They're not my kids. I'm not their parent. I'm not sure I have permission. Should I say anything? Should I raise an alert? What should I do? If you just sat there with your oxygen flow unimpeded, breathing deeply and watch the children around you be subject to that, it would be evil. It wouldn't just be negligent. Well, may I humbly submit, and I've been a part of this. This is my watch too. We've been way too silent while 60 million children lost their lives.